Hello, welcome to the Stratacom Portfolio and Program Management Overview with Atlassian Jira Service Management. So what is Portfolio and Program Management? Portfolio and Program Managers face a unique set of challenges when attempting to track goals, progress, and spend. Standard management techniques don't align. The Stratacom solution answers the call by collaborating the delivery of both operations and program management in a consolidated JSM space. The components of PPM, demand management involves capturing, prioritizing, and evaluating requests for work or initiatives within an organization. A project is a temporary endeavor with a specific start and end date aimed at creating a unique product, service, or result. A program is a collection of related projects managed together to achieve strategic goals. And lastly, a portfolio encompasses various programs and projects within an organization. To be clear, projects fit within programs, which in turn fit within portfolios. Demand management feeds into the pipeline of potential projects and programs. Program managers coordinate related projects, while portfolio managers oversee the big picture. Here's an overview of the Stratacom solution. We have dashboard views. There is an overview view of all of portfolio and program management. And then we also have an example individual view of a single portfolio. Of course, these dashboards are perfectly able to be customized and configured to your own needs. Let's go look at these now. This is an example of our overview dashboard. And as you can see, we also have links to various other parts in PPM. We could have additional links. We can have any number listed here that you prefer. Of course, those links could be listed in a separate sidebar on the left to give you kind of like a little bit of a dashboard link view. And so what we're going to do here is we're going to flip over to our individual dashboard. And here you can see our digital transformation portfolio. You can see some details from asset management some health statistics about the various projects that are contained within this portfolio, demands by status, programs, projects, and any other information that you would personally like to see. We're gonna continue on and we're gonna have an overview of the components and then I will go into a demo. PPM starts with demand. End users can start by entering demands from the portal. Demands are entered and submitted to the pipeline. Common information is requested like summary, description, business reason, and expected timeframes. Additionally, specific teams and stakeholders may be identified. The user entering the demand may select the expected portfolio and the program for their request. Demands start off as an idea. The idea is then triaged by the project staff, sent off to be evaluated, and weighted against other ideas before being approved. Approved demands close and become projects. The next level, project. Approved demands are cloned into a project. All of the detail associated to a demand is brought over into the project, which will be managed from the approval of the idea through its eventual implementation. The project is then assessed where supporting information such as budget items, costs, risks, benefits, can also be identified and attached. The project is then scheduled for implementation. Executing phase delivers the product and implements the idea after which the project is closed. Our programs are a roll up of various information from all of the PPM module. Programs are defined in assets and they are collectors of the various projects. Approved users can create programs stored in the asset module in JIRA service management. Anticipated budget, terms, costs, and scoring can be entered here. Any projects using this program can be shown and identified on the right-hand side of the program screen, and you can jump specifically to any one of those. Here we have the roll-up of our portfolio. Portfolio managers start by creating portfolios that strategically align with the organization. Budget and cost items are rolled up into the portfolio so the portfolio managers can be on top of the activity. 
All information will be shown on the right-hand side of the portfolio, allowing instant access. These may be filtered by type or other criteria. In this particular case, you're seeing the projects. And let's go and dive in and perform a demonstration. We're going to go and start off on our port, our portal here. We're going to enter a demand and we can supply a business reason. We can identify the start and end dates for our initiative. We can identify a demand team. Those demand teams can be all of your teams contained within Atlassian Jira Service Management, or it can be a subset. In this particular case, we just have a subset defined for our PPM solution. That You can specify a demand owner, any stakeholders that are in part of this. And also then you can specify your portfolio and add the program to which this applies. And then we're going to go ahead and hit send. And we have now implement, uh, initiated a demand. We're going to go over and look at that from the agent view. And here's what it looks like on the agent view. Of course, you can see that we also have some other information here. We have some status fields that we can track the current status of this particular item. We can identify a t-shirt size. So that is small, medium, and large. We can attach a strategic objective to this. So we can say digitize business processes. We can identify a budget category, any total budget. We're going to go ahead now and review this idea. And at the review stage, that just means that someone is over looking over into it and seeing what needs to be done. We're going to go and send that forward to the evaluate stage. And here you can see that this is an in-progress stage because that turned blue. And now we're going to send this off for approval. When we send it off for approval, it will be stopped until such time as it has either been approved or declined. We're going to approve this particular item. And when we do, you can see that it immediately was closed. And momentarily, you can see that it opened a linked issue for PPM 120, which is our project. Our, this is our project that will implement our demand. And you can see that it copied all of the information that we had specified on our demand over to our project. Here, we can also walk through the process of going through and assessing and move that forward. We're going to actually put in some risks. So here you have the ability to put in any risks, budget, benefits, all of those items are identified here as subtasks that will be attached to this particular item. You could drill in once you actually have identified and you can put in more information about that particular item, what type of risk it is and what the impact to the organization is and what is the probability that the risk is going to happen. And from there, risks can go just from to do to in progress and then be identified as we know we're going to get done. Okay, there we go. Whoops, I didn't select a resolution. So we're going to go back to our parent here and we're going to then go and schedule the project and we can go forward to executing. At this point in time, this has been scheduled and we know when it's going to happen and then we can complete the project. Our assets store information about the individual portfolios that make up our PPM solution. Of course, you can create any portfolios that you want, programs that are going to be important to your organization, any strategic objectives that are part of this program, and teams can be identified here as well as budget categories and also budget types. Let me go back to our PPM solution here, and I'm going to go into a different ticket that's not closed. If I am updating information, I can also then go and add a budget item. This is equipment and I need. I also, in the middle, when I'm working through a ticket and I'm entering budget items, I have the ability to add a new budget item if need comes up. And you can see that that item that we just added, if we go and look, 
is now listed here in our solution. And that is basically an overview of our PPM solution. Thank you very much for attending. My name is Kim Euchre, and I am a Stratacom Senior Consultant. And please look into us for more information. Thank you.